just a cold thumb. You want anything else? Nah, I'm heading home. Hey, Tom, uh, before you go, I ask maybe a small favor. Huh? Sure, Luigi, what do you need? Walk my daughter home. Sarah, the way I hear it, she doesn't need any kind of escort. <laughs> She's uh, she's a tough. This is a pack of boys who need her place. Uh, the punks, you know, cattivi ragazzi. They talk blue, make advances. Sarah, she's gonna speak at the mind. But maybe she says something they don't like. Things get ugly. But if you work in at home, this is a reminder of these punks she's the dawn's a god daughter. No problem, Luigi. I'd be honest. <laughs> Benny. Sarah, time is to close. What's this then? Uh, Tom is. Uh, Tom's gonna take you. That right. Hey, I just work here. Make sure nobody bother you. Fine. If it'll make you feel better, Pop. Hey. I'll see you tomorrow. Let me get my coat. I'll wait for you outside. You okay? I don't need anyone walking me home. Hey, we were talking about me not tonight anyway. I guess. And you can quit worrying about what he's gonna think. Not the point, Tom. He treats me like a kid sometimes. Hey, I get it. He's protective. He's seen things. We've all seen things. You know, we gotta talk about you stealing food. Hey, I cook it, so I get to say where it goes. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another video of Mafia. Well, maybe tomorrow's finally gonna be the day he Make sure you show some love, like, and subscribe, and enjoy the video. We're right now walking Sarah to her apartment. We just arrived. Could you knock on the door? Only got so many hands here. Yeah, I got you. Sarah! That for me? Yeah, though it's not as much as last time. It's enough. Nona thinks you're an angel. The Dawn hates seeing food go to waste. And this? This has got to be Tammy. Sarah told us all about you. That right. You're a famous race driver, Tom. Everyone talks about you. Yeah, she's right. They do. Well, anyways, don't let the cold in, Juliet. I'll see you at church. All right. Have a great evening. Night. When I know they me. Glad to know they speak about me. I guess that's what comes with being famous. It's nice you do that. That? Well, a lot of hungry people on this block. Yeah. Well, it's um, it's a good night for a walk anyway. Don't get yourself killed on my account, Tom. I try to avoid it. That's all you got? You spent all this <laughs> I time forgot to look both ways. Like Sam Trapani, and the best line you got is "Good night for a walk, anyways." <laughs> well, it is, ain't it? Yeah, I guess so. You're walking a little too fast. What's going on? Flowers for the lady, Signore. Yes, yeah, sir. Now I don't get flowers? When you let me take you on a real date and not some walk home for Luigi, then Ooh. you get the flowers. Ooh. Eh, that could happen. If Pop's not gonna stop me seeing one of you, I think he knows anyway. Luigi? Nah. These guys have been creeps to me for weeks. But I didn't tell you as I know what you like. I mentioned it to Dad this one time and all of a sudden he gets you to be my knight in shining armor. So yeah, he knows. Huh. Well, like I say, 
Means there's no problem with me. If you did, you wouldn't last long. I know what happened to all the other guys I dated. I helped hide the bodies. Uh, what the so fuck? I've been trying to keep you safe, Tom and Angelo. All this time. Then let's go someplace. Tomorrow night, maybe. The pictures, maybe. You can get your flowers. That'd be good. Oh! Hey there, darling! Are you stepping out on us? Piss off. <laughs> Don't cast the kitten, doll face. We'll let your boyfriend watch. What do you say? We going to have trouble here. Trouble started back when you tried to steal our girl, Chief. You saps aren't careful. You'll end up in wooden overcoats. <laughs> Last chance to walk away. We ain't frails. We know who you work for. Salieri might have been the big six when he was younger, but he's all washed up now. Mm -hmm. It's only a matter of time before Morello punches his ticket. I don't need Salieri. Or anyone else. Not for this. <laughs> well, this <laughs> then let's see what you got, cake eater. Mm. Uh, let's go, punks. One down, who's next? Who else want the work? I done told ya. Oh, you bringing nice into the fight. Damn, well, that's what's gonna happen to you. For sure. Hey, 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 leave her alone, bro. Damn. Woo. Tommy. Damn. Bitch made my foe. Come on, let's go. Now. Hope you're better than your friends. All right, let's go. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, I don't know who y'all fucking with. Oh, okay. I underestimated you. That's Shit. what I got, you son of a bitch. Let's go, Tommy. That's how it's done. Let me swap it for the bat. A good right hook. I'll give you that. You're bleeding. Come up to my place. I'll take a look. I had to teach these punks a lesson. Well, you gonna come in and take a load off or what? I'm wondering when you'd invite me up. The bank's closed, slugger. I'm just gonna patch you up is all. Now go sit down on the couch, roll up your sleeve. I'm getting my sewing kit. Doesn't look too bad. You need something for the pain? I know, I'm fine. You don't have to do that. What? I can see it fucking hurts, Tom. You wanna pretend it don't go ask Polly to staple you up. What do you get? Compliments of the Don. <laughs> Take another. <sighs> All right. You gonna grin and bear this? Yeah, I'll be okay. Good. I don't need the little old lady next door complaining to the super about all the racket. Just be quick about it, will ya? Well, it's gonna take as long as it takes. The sloppier the stitch, the uglier the scar. That right. You stitched up a lot of fellas. Just my father. I would really go after Luigi sometimes. 
He got pretty good at ducking dinner plates. So one day she stabbed him with her knitting needle. Right through the hand. What for? Because she was an ugly, jealous drunk. There. Not my best work, but it'll hold. The scar would be something to remember you by, if nothing else. <laughs> You're staying over. Can't have you stumbling through the neighborhood pie-eyed. Not when them hoods are out looking for you anyways. Yeah, okay. You got an extra blanket or something? No. And the heat's out. Yes, I'll go. Chapter complete, Sarah. Let's move on to the next. Better get used to it. 1932. This can't stand. Sarah's okay, boss. I took care of it. She started working here before she could see over the bar. I don't have a daughter of my own, Tom. I'd do anything for Luigi's little girl. So would I. We all would. That's right, boss. Anything for Luigi and Sarah. Do those bastards think this is fucking Luna Park or something? I'll rip them apart with my own hands. Our business is protection. But who's gonna pay up when they learn we can't even protect one of our own as she walks home from work? So what do you want us to do? Teach these boys a lesson. Break every bone in their bodies. Put them in wheelchairs. Bust their faces up so bad, even their mothers can't look at them without screaming. We know where they're holed up. My friend on the force says we should start looking into Chinatown. Then Big Biff will know something. Tommy, go to Vinny, get us some gear. Meet me at Biff's place. Yeah, okay. Leave these punks laying in the street. I want everyone to know we do not allow mad dogs to run wild in our neighborhood. You got it, boss. <laughs> Some of these sons of bitches can still be on our turf. I'll check the neighborhood. Make sure they're gone while you see Biff. Good hunting. Yeah, same. Okay, so when you're done with Vinny, come find me in Chinatown. But sure. Let's go bust these some heads. These punks showing disrespect. Hell yeah. Let's go see Vincenzo, aka Vini. Then we all dripped out. Look at that drip. Hey, hey, here for some heaters, Tom. Nah, I'm already going and healed. Paulie and me, we gotta give a beating to some punks who've been on our turf. I don't want to pull this and piss in our own street. There's something to bust sets. That's all we need. Sam turned over some guy's warehouse and, uh... Autographed by Babe Ruth himself, the guy said. I mean, it's horse shit, but... They bust heads. Your punks won't have time for questions. Not at all. Thanks, Vinny. Alright, here we go. Should we take this? Can we take this one? Woo! Nah, we'll leave it. Seems like it belongs to somebody. It's a blue one it is. Let's go bust some heads. Watch out. You see me coming? Oh, snap. Right in front of the cop. He ain't gonna do nothing. It's our turn. I heard 
Chinatown. Just up ahead. Let's go. There's Polly. About time. Come on, I'm wet through. Why Biff moved into this dump, I'll never know. Give him a break. He's in love. She uh, looks nice. Got yellow fever the time we boosted the shit. Nice theme they got going on. Well, I like her anyways. Problem with you, Tom, you always soft with the games. He's right about that. Pawn shop. Biff, you fat bastard. How you doing? Chut mau, no chin. Li tang all day chin. Don't they send us all get in by such a light? Dog face, great to see you. Call her off, Biff. We got business. Upstairs, please. Mu yong fai tai. So, what's the beef? Need some information. Got some jokers causing trouble. They mess with Luigi's daughter. Plenty of hoods around. You got any more? One of them's a weasel named Billy. Pals with a prissy chump and a bruiser with a bald head. Right, right, I know them. They're set up in the old service station a block over. They hock some gear every now and then, in small time. <laughs> That's why I need to come to you, Biff. You're good with small time. Out the back, cross the street. You'll find them there. Thanks. See you around. Hey, Polly. Uh, about that dough? Relax, just waiting for my guy to come through. It'll be next week. Just sit tight. Appreciate the info, though. Oh, what's this? What's this? Magazine. What was that back there? You and Biff got something going on. Guy I know is bringing in a shipment of suits. Classy ones. Mexican. You're getting suits from Mexico? No, idiot. The suits are boosted from a lockup downtown. The tailor is from Mexico. Originally, anyways, he lives in Holbrook. Did Don know about this? Yeah, yeah, he'll get his cut. You just keep this under your hat. I guess I heard nothing. You gonna know these punks when you see them? Yeah. Though, I guess if I don't, all we gotta do is find the other guys in Chinatown who look like we do. There it is. Fuck they at. I want all the smoke for what they did. I can't pull out my bat already. Oh, no, I can't. Walk in and start beating people. Do the same. No shooters. You take long thinking that one up. Nah, this plane gets used a lot. I think we gotta go in through the side. Tell me the nicest ass I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo. Oh, Billy, it's the guy from the other night. We gotta go. Oh, yeah. Come get him. Guys, get in That's here. So get him, tough. Tom. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Got him fucked up. Just me and you. Damn. Over the fence, Tom, before they get away. Don't let him get Billy. Get your hands behind something. Oh, shit, they're shooting. I go north, you go south. What? I go up, you go through there. I'm, I'm, good thinking, good thinking. Billy, we gotta go now. Run, go. Woo! Yeah, we're causing havoc. Getting crazy out here. 
Get some ammunition. Let's go. Let's go. They're behind something. Oh, snap. Damn. I let you. Hell nah. He wasn't gonna creep up on me. Let's grab the shoddy. It's a nice one too. Come on, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Damn, they keep turning. That's what I didn't want. All right, good, good, good. I'm trying to crash. If we crash, I'm going to fall behind. You ever what? see guys piss their pants this quick? If you look through the rain, you can see it dripping out the back of their car. <laughs> Mo, 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 you see me coming? Oh, no. Come on, that was you're close. This. We're almost there, we're almost there. Start shooting before they turn again. Damn, these cars are whack. Looking nice though, but whack. These guys are gonna regret they ever set eyes on Sarah, huh? Oh, they crashed. Dumb son of a bitch just wrecked himself. Well, they're not walking away from that. I want to pop in time. No. No, no, wait. Please. Please, I don't want to. Do it. Die Do it. Christ, Tom. You can't feel sorry for these animals. A guy like this would plug you if you give him the chance. You gotta pull the trigger without thinking. Some out. This one's finished too. Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> mm. 
Oh Christ, Tom. Nah. Snap out of it. You remember what those guys wanted to do to Sarah? Yeah. Just uh Hey. Let's get out of here before the bulls show up, huh? Chapter complete. Now I know why it's called that. Because, yeah, he better get used to it. It's going to be a lot more killing. But let's move on. The saint and the sinner. Simple, straight. Oh. I can't afford this life no more. Just getting lucky. I'll give you a chance to win your money back. You want in, boss? We have business to discuss, Paulie. We're in it now, boys. One of our associates at the coroner's office sent this over. Corpse's name is Giolotti. You recognize him? Sure. That's one of the punks we ran out of the neighborhood. Now we got the bullet in the back of his head? Yeah. We capped him. Well, the cops ought to thank us. We did him a favor. The guy was a rapist, boss. Yeah? Well, he was also a city councilor's son. You want to drive a politician into Morella's arms? There's no better way than killing off his family. Oh, Christ. That gets worse. You left another guy in the wreck? Yeah, but he was dead when we got there. You gonna tell me he was the president's nephew or something? Two in the head, Pauly. If you're gonna do a job, do it right. He made it? Yes. He spent the week in St. Mary's, but he pulled through. <sighs> Can he point a finger at either of you? I don't know. Maybe. Okay. Look. We're gonna kill two birds with one blast. Galati's funeral's today at St. Michael's. Sam, you're gonna attend. Sit in the back and try to spot the lucky bastard. How will I recognize him? He'll be the one who just crawled away from a car wreck. His arm is broken. Look for a sling. Sam's gonna need a little distraction if he's gonna clean up your mess. You sending Tommy to dip his wick? It's a brothel? A gentleman's club, just down the street from St. Michael's. Madonna's invested a lot of money in it over the years. So me and Sam. Regardless, the owner has suddenly decided to do business with Morello instead of us. You want me to go remind him of his obligations? Yes. Then blow the place up. What? Morello wants to take businesses away from us? He'll inherit craters. Look, Tom, we can't send Paulie and Sam since all the ladies know them already. They'd never make it through the front door. But you can walk right in. Okay. What about the manager? Take care of him wherever you find him. If any of the horse see it, well... It'll be a warning. Once he's out of the way, head to his office on the top floor. Grab any documents and money you find there, and place the explosives. Vincenzo will see that you have what you need. And you think the blast will be big enough to give me cover? Yeah. But be smart. Only take a shot if you know you won't get me. Tommy, one more thing. One of the girls is passing Morello information about our operations. Before you blow the place, you'll need to take care of her, too. You want Tommy to kill a twist? Come on, Frank. It's just bad luck this falls to Tom. But we gotta protect the family. Her name is Michelle. She's usually working one of the upper rooms. Her photo is in the folder. You boys clear on everything? Yeah. Tom. I got it, boss. Then get it done. Oh, shit just went sideways quickly. Sam knows the girl, too. You can see it in his face. Go see Vinny. I'll meet you here. For sure. Can't believe that guy actually survived. A car crash, a bullet, bam. 
Hell yeah, I can use that. Give those girls a squeeze from Uncle Vin, huh? Not today, Vinny. We have to talk. Yeah, we blowing that shit up. He's gonna tell me right here the secret. Don't watch. go any place yet. You gotta hear me out on this. It's about the girl. Michelle? Right. You don't have to rub her out. Just make her disappear. You know her? Yeah. I've been with her a few times. She's a good egg, Tom. Just maybe not so bright. She doesn't deserve to get plugged just because she likes listening to me talk. You think she'll leave town? When she understands what'll happen otherwise. Yeah, she'll leave. Here's a hundred. Give it to her. And make sure she gets far away. Okay, Sam. I'll see what I can do. That's all I'm asking. Let's go. Should I let her live? Or whack her? I don't know. Michelle. She's the one from the racetrack, right? Tom, that was the last time we're ever gonna talk about her. Ever. I told you what I had to ask, and you listened. Gotta leave it there. Okay. Keep your head when you get into the hotel. Find your mark and don't act suspicious. The manager thinks he's untouchable. You can probably walk right up to him. Anything else I should know? Nah. Just don't take all day. A lot he died young, so there can't be much to say about him. When the bomb goes off, I'll do my thing. Got it. Right, that's what's up. Respect, what respect. What kind of world is it that when you screw up, you get sent to a cat house? Well, I have to clean up your mess at a funeral. You see the justice in that? I see a job I gotta do. Such a professional. Just try to finish a job this time, huh? First time I've been to a church in a while. Well, I'm gonna guess they're still singing the same songs. Last time I went, it was. Same songs I always heard as a kid. Yeah, you're not the religious type. It's the funerals, Tom. That's all it ever is. All that anyone ever wants to do is point guns at the family and shoot. Game point, there were so many funerals, I just stopped going to most of them. They're all boring as hell. That's a shame, seeing as you're always dressed for the occasion. Great gag, Tom. Write that one down. Thanks. I'll do that. Now, weddings. Weddings are less boring. I'd go to one of them. You working on that? Uh, I guess so. Good. Because I've given up waiting on Polly. I couldn't get a broad to stick to him if they went swimming through glue. Uh, they'll <laughs> find someone. Tom, if his own mother has given up hope, then you can give up hope too. Here's your stuff. Handle your business. I'll give the family your condolences. Good luck. You too. Alright, I'm moving. Relax. the hotel hey you behave yourself in here okay who the fuck are you let me just talk to him <laughs> know where I can find the manager I just watch the door pal All right. hey handsome you here for a girl drinks or a mix of the two a girl. And I got some business with your manager, too. A girl I can help you with. Come through. Find the girl you like, and you can both get better acquainted upstairs. There's no rush, so get a drink, relax, and enjoy yourself. Hey, good afternoon, sir. What up? Ooh, just how I like them. 
Why don't you buy me a drink? Because you're not the dame I'm after. You know Michelle? I'm new here, baby. I don't know a thing. Damn, man. Eh? Come on, honey. Without you, how am I gonna pay the rent? I can tell you're nervous, but I can step you through what we gotta do. Hey, I'm looking for Michelle. You know her? Yeah, she's the popular one. Book yourself in with a guy at reception. You gotta get in line for Michelle. Damn. Where's reception? We can just talk if you don't want anything else. We can do whatever you want. Where's reception at? Is it over here? I need to talk to the manager. Yeah, head straight through to the lounge. You're with our uh, new business partners, I assume. Yeah. That's the one. The friendship between the Corleone Hotel and the Morello family will be long and fruitful. I think everybody's gonna walk out. I'm gonna just wait. I think that's the manager, though. Let me have a word with him. Are you with the Morello party, sir? What the fuck? I can't kill him yet. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There's a question right here. I need to speak to Michelle. The only girls available are the girls you can see. Find one you like. And don't make a fuss. Fuck, man. I think that's reception, right? You get a room when you get a guy, not before. Ah, <sighs> fine. You know the rules, Dottie. Is Michelle in today? Let me check. She's in, but she's busy. If you're waiting for Michelle to come down, she ain't gonna. She's got fellas in with her all day long. What the fuck? You looking for a good time? Come this way, sweetie. Nah, I'm looking for a friend. Michelle. Sure you are. Come to my room and tell me all about her. I just want to talk. You know, I get to hear that a lot. I bet you're not like all the other guys either, are you? Nah, not really. I gotta kick this door in, damn. Got some havoc. Why are you leading me to Michelle or what's up? Where's Michelle? Upstairs in 208. That all you want? That's all I want. I <sighs> wish they were all like you, sweetheart. Upstairs 208. Oh, fuck. You know, I gotta keep it down. What the stairs at? I thought I gotta take the elevator up. You treat women like this? You treat your mother like this? No, please! <laughs> Don't like when it's dulled out, do you? There we go. This room's blended furniture, warm welcome, good company. Oh, that's your car, toy. What's it to you? A fella named Sam is one of your regulars. Maybe there's a lot of guys named Sam. You know him. 
works for Don Celieri. Maybe you got him talking about our business from time to time, and maybe Don Morello offered you some money to spill what you heard. No, Sam, trust me, I, I don't say nothing, he knows that. Well, the Don's losing a lot of money because someone <laughs> can't keep their mouth shut. I was just bumping cars with some of Morello's girls. I didn't mean nothing by it. Tell him I'm sorry. Tell him I won't never open my mouth again. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm scared then. Good. Don't you ever forget how it feels to be this scared. To know you're just one twitch away from a hole in the ground. Because if you ever show your face in this town again, they're gonna find you with two in the head. Do you understand? Lucky for you, Sam's got a big heart. Get dressed and make tracks. This place is gonna blow soon. Thank you. Just don't come back and we're square. Damn. Don't come back. Do it all day tomorrow with Morello's guys. I'll be downstairs in the lounge sending them up. They get what they want as much as they want. You complain, you lose your place. There's plenty more girls like you. Damn! Come up to my office on the top floor and the... Much of you feel like changing your mind. My mind, I mean. Alright, now that we gotta go all the way downstairs. We gotta murk the dude. Can we take the elevator? Nah. Our feet work just fine. That's what they said. There he is right there. Looking tough, look at you. You must be the manager. Don Celieri sends his regards. Oh, yes, sir. Can we cut through here? Say goodnight, punk. Oh, fuck. Keep it quiet for now. Taking cover. Where the fuck they at? All right, so we gotta go upstairs yeah. actually. All day, damn. Let me get a better angle. Yo, get out of here. Oh, you lucky you move. Taking cover. Where's the other one at? Is he upstairs? The manager's office. Get a better shot. Go. Damn. Get 
Cool. Let me grab your gun. Oh no, I don't want to pick up the body. More upstairs. Get a better shot. Go. Shot y'all. It's some ammunition. Sit your ass down. Damn, y'all just let y'all man die like that. He's far from me. Let's go, let's go. Take it cover. Hey. Shootout is going down. Damn, show yourself. Did I kill him? One of them had the time again. Yes, sir. Look at that. Oh yeah. I like. Is that the manager's office right there? Read no the following patrons may be of interest. I have their details should you need them. Several city councilors and congressmen, senior officials, and for what is this? In addition, a number of silly area associates are sweet on our girls and fond of pillow talk. We will keep an ear out for your interest. Oh, this was going out to them, to Mr. Morello. Another letter. Coletti, I must apologize for missing our regular appointment last week. I had urgent family matters to attend to at short notice. It is with some regret that I write to confirm the termination of our agreement. Mr. Soleri has been a wonderful business partner over the years. I am most grateful for his support and your wise counsel. Please find with this missive a return of Mr. Soleri's investment along with $100 as a gesture of goodwill. Damn, that was to us. Letting us letting us know that business was over. We're planning the bomb at under the table. You can make it. Jesus. What other choice we got? Oh, that's a weak. That was a weak ass bomb, though. Is it on fire at least? Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, 
Oh snap, we're two after this upstairs. Yep, I assume so. Damn. Return fire. Let's go, let's go. Just saw a cop right there. You working with Mr. Morello? That's what's gonna happen to you. On the roof with us. Thought you'd get by, didn't ya? We be here to meet you, huh? Here. Move up. Let's go. Where's the other cop at? I mean, damn, bro. What other choice did you leave me? Oh, snap. Night, night. Dang. I'm working helicopters. Where to, where to, where to? What the fuck? Oh, here maybe? I'm here! Come on, come on, put the ladder. Up we go. No contact with the fellow. Oh, shit, it's actually it like we lost him. Oh, there you go, we're escaping. They didn't know we went over here. My question is, are we in the church? I think we're in the the building of the church where Sam is. Damn, so many damn stairs. Oh, there we go. No matter how far we've fallen, we can find redemption in death. Now, William, he was a sinner, yes, but he was also a loving son, a protective brother, and a loyal friend. And for those virtues, we pray that his soul will find salvation. And now I believe one of Billy's closest and dearest friends would like to say a few words. Thank you, Father. I, uh... I just wanted to pay my respects. Billy, I never said this, but... I consider you my brother. I can't even count all the times you saved my ass from a beat. So I don't know how I'm good... What are you doing? Wait, that's the guy. That's the guy who killed Billy! Yeah! Holy fuck, we about to have a shootout at the church? Damn. Please. Where's oh, Sam at? Get over here now! Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Nah, he ain't running. Oh, you lucky. No, no way, I'm missing. Alright, let's slow it down. You could have stopped all this days ago. Moving to cover. His father was here. His mother. This is the way this city works. Oh, damn. Oh, 
Oh snap, I did not actually mean to do that. Okay, let's go, let's go. There it is. What have you done? Murder in the house of God. These men were criminals, father. Thieves. Rapists. Killers. And God would have embraced them if they'd asked for forgiveness. Now, which one of these men might have sought redemption by working with the poor? Which one might have saved just one life? None of us, father. You bastard. This motherfucker don't if die. Any confessions to make, you better do it quick. No more bloodshed, please! I'm sorry, Father. <sighs> Consider this an act of divine retribution. <sighs> that make us even? Sure. For now. For your trouble, father. I don't want your blood money. You took theirs. Not a lot of difference from where I'm standing. That should be enough dough to patch up the bullet holes and keep you quiet. <laughs> when the cops come, you tell them the gunman who did this had East Coast accents. Must have been from out of town, right? I won't lie. But I won't say anything at all. Good. Be a shame if we had to come back here. Where the hell were you? As soon as I walked in the church, the crew recognized me. Followed me straight back out. Where are they now? The same place as all these guys. Come on. We Damn. Got Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Get in, get in. Let's go, let's go. Stop us. They ain't going to. Come on, Tommy. Lose him. I'm trying. Yeah, I'm trying. Fuck. We have the cops again. Whoa, 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 whoa. I think we're good after this. Past this underground tunnel. Yeah, we're good. All cars, pursuit is called off. Abandon search. 
Surge and return to patrol. Okay. We lost them. <sighs> Thank Christ. Gonna be trying to forget today for a long time. You're telling me. Let's get back to the bar. We gotta lie low. The way this all went down, we gotta lie low for weeks. Ah, the priest will keep his trap shut. Don't worry. Morello got a bloody nose. You and Polly are in the clear for whacking Galati's son. Boss will be pleased. Let's hope he is. Thanks again, Sam, for helping me out back there. I thought my time was up. It's not anything you wouldn't do for me. I know. But when you come that close to biting it, Christ, it's something. Don't need to tell me about that. Just don't think about it. Best lesson I could ever teach you. Don't think about anything. There it is, folks. Chapter complete. The saint in the center. And that's going to conclude today's video. Like, subscribe. This was a banger. Share it if you like. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Later.